But for tonight, upper 60s, cool and cloudy, and those showers are fading. I'm a little bit worried about the clouds because we have a pretty awesome lunar eclipse headed our way. Amanda Holly's joining us with the details. Yeah, the longest partial lunar eclipse in about a thousand years on either end here. It does begin at 218 tomorrow morning, so obviously just after midnight, very early. The maximum portion of the eclipse here at 402, that's when about 97% of the moon will be covered in the Earth's shadow. It'll It'll end at about 447 tomorrow, excuse me, 547 tomorrow morning. Now the partial means that not 100% of the moon will be covered in the Earth's shadow. There will still be a sliver of the moon that is exposed and still bright. But unfortunately, uh, we're going to have a lot of cloud cover out there. If we get some breaks in the cloud cover, you'll see the moon turn a red reddish orange shade. And again, a lot of cloud cover expected for the peninsula of Florida here. There will be some breaks. Mm -hmm. You might get lucky if the break is over the moon. Yeah, when I head home tonight around midnight, I'm going to kind of evaluate if I'm setting the yep. alarm or yep. not. <laughs> <laughs> you got to try it at least right, you know, near the maximum. And yeah. if not, well, we'll just see some pictures tomorrow. <laughs> exactly.